Now, I can't continue to express how excited I am to be here at the University of San Francisco as the new men's soccer head coach to be able to continue to push this program towards the success that it's had. I feel completely ready and, and thrilled to take on this new challenge. I was fortunate to inherit a team that has a lot of very, very good pieces, a lot of talent. Um, we were able to add to that talent, and I think if we can piece that all together with a, a fantastic team culture, I think the sky's the limit for this group. First and foremost, I wanted, I wanted to surround myself with people that had a similar mindset to myself, that were very driven, very hardworking, very motivated, but had a, a particular personality that I thought would help build a championship culture here at USF. And I think I've got the right guys and Sam Reynolds and Javier Ayala, I think are gonna be fantastic leaders and mentors to the student athletes here on our soccer team. I think when you look at, at this team, it, it starts from the back. This team has a great goalkeeper in Ruben right off the bat. He's a fantastic leader and just getting to know him off the field um, over the past few months and what he brings to the team and to the program. Um, but he's got three fantastic goalkeepers now in Jay, um, in Ale, in Nolan to push him and, and, and compete with him each and every day. And, they got to keep the ball out of the back of the net. They're the last line of the defense. They can win you games, they can win you championships. And to have a, a good goalkeeper and, and a good goalkeeping core or unit, I think is something that's super important. I think we have a fantastic uh, core group of defenders um, that are returning. Obviously, Bartuito coming back, I think, is going to compete in, to be WCC Defender of the Year. And, and I'm really excited that he's going to be kind of that um, solid uh, piece in the middle of our, our back line. We also have Taiki coming over. He's a junior college transfer, I think, is going to be very, very a uh, strong left-footed player that's going to add to our back line. We have also guys like David Polson who is just a, a ball of energy and brings it every single day in training. He's going to compete every day for that spot on the left side of our back line. Um, we got Jamal who's going to compete on the right side. And then we also have Eden who unfortunately has been out a long time with injury, um, but when he gets fully healthy this season, uh, I think he'll add an extreme amount of depth in the middle of our back line or, or as a right back as well. We have a very good older unit that has a lot of experience and so I think that'll bring a lot of success for us this season. Our midfield, I think, is uh, the group of players that I think I'm most excited about. When we have players like Cam Martin, Ashish, Zion coming back, I think we have a midfield that's going to play or help us play the brand of soccer that I want to play. I want a team that plays through our midfield, that builds from their back, but we need a midfield that's technical enough, that's dynamic enough, that allows us to do that. We got a very good core guys coming back that's going to really um, be the strength of our, our midfield. I think when you look at our front line, I think we have guys that are primed to have a breakout year. When you look at Sandro, when you look at Marcus, when you look at Georgie Ruiz coming back, adding goals or assists um, and really up in those stat marks this year. And so I can't wait to see what those guys do this season. I think when I came in day one in the spring, I didn't have a lot of time to work with the group, but I saw the talent that was in the group from top to bottom of the roster. But I thought that to really create that professional feeling each and every day in training, that you need to create competition and, and bring in top talent to push the guys that are already here. And so, and bringing in these newcomers, we've got kids from all over the country, from all over the world coming in that are really going to push the guys. I'm really excited what uh, Nathan Simeon coming in um, from Orlando City Academy. He's playing professional games in the USL already um, and I think he's going to be primed to come in and compete and push the guys at center back or right back this year. Hokun coming in from Norway, um, an attacking player that I think has goals and assists in his game. He's going to push all the guys on our front line and really compete for playing time. Um, and then we have a Jaden Reynolds coming in from Toronto um, to add and push our center midfielders. Um, could also play out wide as a winger. They know and really feel that they're playing for something that's bigger than themselves. And I know that that will transcend into fighting as hard as they can for, for their brothers or for the player next to them. And the staff and also just the players tactically and technically that are going to play an attractive brand of soccer 
um, that people are going to enjoy watching, um, that are going to be where they're going to be extremely competitive, and I think that's going to really again be something that I look forward to developing this season. And once we can put all those pieces together, I think the sky's the limit for for this program.